Have you ever wondered how much you're truly worth? It's not a question of how much cash you have in your pocket right now. It's about your net worth, a term that might sound a bit intimidating, but it's actually a simple concept. Think of it as a snapshot of your financial health. It's the total value of everything you own, your assets, minus what you owe, your liabilities. Understanding net worth can give you a clear picture of your financial health. Let's start by looking at some of the world's wealthiest individuals. In the Billionaires Club, a name that frequently pops up is Jeff Bezos, founder of Amazon. His wealth isn't just from a salary, it's largely tied to his ownership in Amazon. When the company does well, his net worth skyrockets. The fluctuation in Amazon's stock price directly impacts his wealth, making him a billionaire many times over. Next in line, we have Elon Musk, the visionary behind SpaceX and Tesla. Musk's wealth, like Bezos's, is largely tied to his companies. When Tesla's stock price goes up, so does Musk's net worth. He isn't just earning a paycheck, he's building wealth through his stakes in his companies. His approach to investing in his own ventures has placed him among the wealthiest individuals on the planet, not forgetting Warren Buffett, the Oracle of Omaha. Unlike Bezos and Musk, who have built their wealth through tech companies, Buffett has done so through savvy investments. His company Berkshire Hathaway owns a diverse range of businesses, and Buffett's personal wealth is tied to the success of these companies. He's not simply drawing a massive salary, he's strategically investing and reaping the rewards. These three individuals, Bezos, Musk, and Buffett, epitomize the concept of net worth. It's not about how much you earn in a year, it's about your assets, your businesses, your investments. It's about what you own, minus what you owe. And these gentlemen own quite a lot. Their wealth isn't just tied to their income, it's tied to their influence, their ownership, their stakes in successful ventures. They're not just earning, they're creating, investing and growing their wealth. It's a game of numbers, and these guys know how to play. So, when we talk about the wealth of these individuals, we're not just talking about their income, we're talking about their net worth, their assets, their investments. We're talking about their ability to generate wealth, not just earn it. These individuals illustrate how net worth encompasses more than just income. But what about those in the limelight, our favorite celebrities? Let's start with Taylor Swift, the pop sensation who has been winning hearts since she was a teenager. Swift's net worth is a result of her multiple hit albums, sold-out tours, and her savvy business moves. She's not just a singer but also a songwriter, and that adds a significant chunk to her earnings. Her endorsement deals with major brands have also contributed to her wealth. Then we have LeBron James, a household name in basketball. His net worth isn't just from his NBA salary. James has lucrative endorsement deals with companies such as Nike and Coca-Cola. He's also a savvy investor with stakes in the Liverpool Football Club and Blaze Pizza Chain. Plus, his production company Spring Hill Entertainment has produced movies and TV shows adding another layer to his income. And let's not forget Robert Downey Jr., the man who brought Iron Man to life. His earnings from the Marvel Cinematic Universe alone are staggering. But Downey too has diversified his income. He has production companies, Team Downey and Downey Ventures, which have produced films and digital content. He also has brand endorsements and real estate investments. These celebrities don't rely solely on their main careers for income. They understand the importance of having multiple streams of income. Taylor Swift, for instance, doesn't just make money from music. She earns from songwriting, endorsements, real estate, and even her own line of merchandise. LeBron James, aside from his NBA salary and endorsements, earns from his investments and production company. And Robert Downey Jr., aside from his acting career, earns from his production company's endorsements and investments. Their wealth is not solely a result of their talent or fame. It's also a result of their smart financial moves, their ability to diversify their income sources. It's a lesson that anyone, not just celebrities, can take to heart. As you can see, diversifying income sources can significantly increase net worth. However, a high net worth doesn't guarantee financial stability. This statement may seem counterintuitive but allow me to shed some light on it. Let's take a look at two Hollywood superstars, Johnny Depp and Nicolas Cage, both of whom have been caught in the crosshairs of financial instability despite their high net worth. Johnny Depp, the charismatic pirate from the Caribbean, had a net worth of over $600 million at the peak of his career. However, due to extravagant spending and poor financial management, he found himself nearly $200 million in debt. His collection of over 14 residences, a yacht, and a penchant for buying expensive art didn't help his case. Then we have Nicolas Cage, the National Treasure star, once worth $150 million. 
Cage's downfall was a result of a shopping spree that would make even the most extravagant spenders blush. He bought castles, islands, dinosaur skulls, and even rare albino king cobras. His reckless purchases coupled with a $15 million tax lien led to financial ruin. These stories serve as a stark reminder that having a high net worth isn't a bulletproof vest against financial instability. It's not just about accumulating wealth, it's about managing it wisely. It's about understanding the difference between assets and liabilities, between needs and wants. It's about planning for the future, about investing wisely, about understanding the value of money. People often see celebrities and their glamorous lifestyles and assume that they are financially invincible. But the truth is, no amount of wealth can protect you if you're not wise with your money. It's not the size of the wealth that matters, but how you handle it. So while it's easy to get caught up in the glitz and glamour of the high life, let's not forget the importance of financial education and responsibility. The tales of Depp and Cage are cautionary tales, reminding us that even stars can fall from the financial sky. Remember, it's not just about earning wealth, but managing it wisely. On the other hand, there are those who have built their net worth from scratch. Let's dive into the captivating tales of self-made millionaires who have written their success stories with the ink of determination, resilience, and vision. Take, for instance, the story of Oprah Winfrey. Born into poverty, Oprah's journey to becoming a billionaire is nothing short of inspirational. She faced numerous hurdles, but it was her sheer willpower and determination that led her to create a media empire. Her net worth didn't come from inheritance or luck, but from her own hard work and ingenuity. Oprah saw an opportunity in the media industry and seized it, creating a platform that not only increased her net worth but also touched countless lives. Let's also consider Howard Schultz, the man behind Starbucks. Born in a low-income family in Brooklyn, Schultz worked his way up from a bartender to the CEO of a global coffee empire. His secret? Spotting an opportunity in the market for high-quality coffee and exploiting it to the fullest. His entrepreneurship and wise investments have led him to accumulate a net worth that many can only dream of. These stories are not just about financial success but also about overcoming adversity, believing in oneself, and making wise decisions. They show us that it's not just about having money, but about what you do with it. It's about spotting the right opportunities, taking calculated risks, and having the perseverance to see your vision through. In the end, it's not just about becoming a millionaire or a billionaire, it's about setting a goal, working tirelessly towards it, and making the most out of the opportunities that come your way. The tales of self-made millionaires like Oprah Winfrey and Howard Schultz are testament to the fact that increasing your net worth isn't always about inheriting wealth or winning the lottery. It's about hard work, smart choices, and a little bit of luck. These stories show that with the right strategies and perseverance, anyone can increase their net worth. So, what does all this mean for you? Let's summarize the key takeaways from our discussion today. Firstly, understanding net worth is crucial. It's more than just a number. It's a snapshot of your financial health, a clear, concise picture of where you stand. It's the sum total of your assets minus your liabilities, and it can tell you a lot about your financial security. Next, we've seen the importance of diversifying income. The billionaires and self-made millionaires we've discussed didn't get there by sticking to one source of income. They invested in a variety of sectors, spread their risk, and as a result, saw their net worth grow. Third, managing wealth wisely is key. We've seen the fallen stars, those who had it all and lost it due to poor financial decisions. It's not enough to accumulate wealth. You must also know how to manage it to make it work for you. Finally, remember that increasing your net worth is a possibility for anyone. It's not just for the rich and famous. With the right mindset, the right decisions, and a little bit of luck, you can increase your net worth. So, take these lessons to heart. Reflect on them and consider how they apply to your own financial journey. Remember, your net worth is a snapshot of your financial health. Make it a priority to understand and increase it. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and comment. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to keep up with the latest content.